Hello everyone, welcome to Brian Unbox. In this video, we're gonna look at a retractable sunshade by EV Base. This is for your Tesla Model Y. So inside, it comes with the, uh, the frame for the uh, sunshade. So basically this is the, the honeycomb uh, style. And then it comes with um, two of the uh, support. Uh, bars that will go in the front and in the back. It comes with the uh, screws, gloves, and uh, a screwdriver. And then it comes with the cover that will line uh, the border of the shade. So as far as prep, uh, you'll have to install the, uh, the front and then the rear bars. And then the actual frame for the the shade, you'll have to uh, install the screws so it doesn't uh, fold. So in the middle, there's these uh, two points that you'll um, use the black screws to secure the frame into place. Okay, so I uh, used the black screws and I uh, inserted them in this uh, plastic piece here on both sides. So now the frame is, is set up and again, you can just pull these on each side and you see the, the honeycomb uh, shade. Along the uh, border of the uh, frame, you have Velcro, which that, um, that cover will attach to. So I'll go ahead and uh, install it in the vehicle. All right, now I've installed the uh, front and the rear support beam. So this is the front. Just follow the arrows and uh, push it as far as you can. And then uh, you wanna remove um, these uh, screws so you can mount the uh, shade. And here's a look at the rear support beam. I push it as far as I can. And again, you wanna remove the screws on each side so uh, you can mount the uh, shade. Okay, now I installed the, uh, the sunshade, the frame. Um, I would definitely recommend uh, another set of hands. Just makes things a lot easier so someone can support the back and then uh, you can screw the front and then vice versa. So I've secured the uh, frame by uh, screwing the uh, screws in the four corners. And you can see here the rear. And then along the edge, you have the uh, Velcro. So this is where the, uh, the liner will attach. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, proceed with uh, installing the liner. So as far as the, the glass, um, you do lose a little bit with, with the liner and the whole frame. So you can see here in the front um, how much it takes up the space as well as on the side here. So retracting it and uh, closing it is fairly simple. If you just want to do the front, you can do that. And if you want to do the rear, uh, you can just do that as well. So if you want to retract the front, just pull like so. Very easy. And then it, it just glides on the rails very smooth. Then it, it locks into place like that. And I'll show the back in a minute here. As far as the, uh, the gaps, I don't see any gaps. Um, it's pretty flush as far as the uh, liner. Now a view from the rear seat. Again, you can see where it meets here in the middle. And then looking at the, uh, the cover. Again, it's very flush with the upholstery. And then retracting it is just like the front. Here you go, you get a full view of the, uh, the glass. And moving it back up is simple. Again, it slides very easy on the rails and it uh, looks really good here. Okay, my thoughts on the retractable shade. Um, I really like this honeycomb uh, type design that, that's uh, retractable. On my uh, last uh, Tesla, on my Model 3, I had uh, 
pretty much the, the same um, type of shade, but by another uh, brand. And it, it worked well. And I just like the flexibility of being able to, you know, open and close it and enjoy the, the glass roof. So when it comes to the assembly process and installation, um, it's pretty straightforward. The only thing I would recommend is just have another set of hands once you're installing the frame um, because you do need to screw in the four corners and it's kind of hard when you don't have um, support in the rear or the front while uh, you're lining up everything. But it um, should take no longer than 20 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes, and it's uh, pretty straightforward. So as far as heat reduction, I've had this particular type of design with the honeycomb uh, material in my previous Tesla and it definitely reduces the heat. Uh, one great thing about this is that you don't have to fumble around with those different types of shades where you have to unfold it, mess around with the clips. And then if you want to enjoy the glass roof, you have to remove the whole thing. Um, again, with this type of retractable shade, it's just a few seconds and you get to enjoy the whole uh, glass. So I've left the link in the description box below if you want to check out this retractable shade for your Tesla Model Y by EV Base. If you like my video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button as well. Until next time, this is Brian Unbox. Take care, everyone.